Well, here we are again. <laughs> the purpose for today? Not a video about giving up and don't give up. Today's a holiday here in Croatia. It's boiling hot, like 35 degrees plus. People are swimming in the river. The beach is full on the island across. And it's amazing. But it's really hot. That's okay. So, lots of energy going on, lots of things happening around the world, lots of things happening in our life. And these energies are intense and they're driving us further and further and further to our authentic self, to our authentic truth and to those things that really have a purpose in our life. So if you're struggling with various things in your life, perhaps it's time to let them all go. Perhaps it's time to change your location, change your home, change your environment, change your job, change something. Because I'm sure that those that are feeling this low vibration have got something they need to do. And that means ending and the beginning of something new. So if you're going through struggles, and I know that there are many of you that are, the underlying message is don't give up. There's really, you can't go back now. You've got to this point in your life where your ego is really struggling to, to pull you back and to drag you back into this th third dimension, which is really not going to serve you. And this is the conflict within. And any areas of your life that need to be addressed, they're certainly coming up now. Many questions and no answers. But believe me, you have all the answers. You know, your soul knows where you should be going, what you should be doing, and how you to get there. It just requires you to make that decision to stop, break free, release those chains, and step forward. And procrastination is one of those things that haunts us all. We don't want to do this because of that. We can't do this because of that. There's something else I need to wait for before this happens and that. This is all nonsense. You're empowering your ego to determine what you do and where you go, when your heart knows exactly where it's supposed to be and your heart knows exactly where it's supposed to go. You may not know within your mind where you're supposed to go, but your soul knows that you're supposed to do something and your soul will always guide you and there will always be an answer. So, don't give up. Continue to battle through this is whatever is bubbling inside you and Maybe you have to release something. Maybe you do have to let something go that is dear to you and near to you. A lot of it is to do with your psychology. A lot of it is to do with maybe family, friends and relatives. It's time for all of us to stand up, stand into the light, step into the light and move forward knowing that what we're doing is true. True for ourselves and true for so many other people. Because there's no moving away from signs and synchronicities. There's no moving away by from people that you've connected with, people that you no longer resonate with and people that you are resonating with. And there may be a conflict there too. You're being pulled from pillar to post. So like I've said before, take a day off, take a week off, take a month off, go into solitude, go into yourself because you will be, you are the only one that knows what you need to do. And by going into solitude and stepping away from all those things around you that are normally around you are gonna, is going to help you. It's going to help you paint a picture that's clear and is going to energize you into making those decisions. And any most decisions that we don't make are because of fear. And where does fear come from? It's not love, is it? So it's really time to push away all of these low vibrations and be this wonderful this wonderful being of light that you are, and move forward, knowing that you're taken care of, knowing that you are worthy, and knowing that you deserve everything that's for your highest good. You know, yesterday was solstice, or today, or yesterday is the solstice. Tomorrow's a new moon, so energies are really, really up in the air, and we are being pushed to reach that point of insanity, we're reaching the point of nirvana. We're reaching our own true authentic self. 
and that true authentic self is just bursting to come out. If you have issues from your past that are still unresolved, do an inner child meditation, a guided meditation. There's one on my website, take a look at it, it's under additional tools to help you. Look at where you're going, make a plan for the next two to three weeks about your desires, your wishes, what you would like to achieve from your life. What you want, would like to achieve, not what others would like to achieve for you, but what you would like to achieve. Because that's your blueprint and everything else will take, uh, take the course that it's supposed to take. When you break yourself away from certain things, a burden is lifted from your shoulders. And when you lift burdens off your shoulders, you're releasing that negativity out and you're allowing the new to come in. You should never forget that you are love and not this boxed love that humanity has created, this pure love energy that you are. That's what's trying to come out and that is what your ego is resisting. Our ego will always be there. It's forever with us. It's mastering that ego so that we have control over it, not our ego having control over us. Keep following the signposts, keep following the signs and synchronicities and do this in pure faith that what you believe is true because these signposts wouldn't be there if, they weren't, if it wasn't real, if it wasn't true, if it wasn't supposed to happen. And allow the universe and the energies and your manifestation and your projection and your visualizations to become a reality. The closer you get, the closer your signs and synchronicities are. And when you look backwards, you'll figure out where you are, why you're doing what you're doing, and potentially what you're going to be doing in the future. That's exactly what I've done. That's exactly what I do every day. And every day when I look backwards, I can see a reason for being in this situation today. I can see a reason why people aren't in my life today. And I know that there are things that I need to do and that I will do that will be that foundation of my future, of my destiny and my legacy. Because we all have a legacy to give and we all have a legacy that will help the future generations be in prosperity, be in love and be in peace and harmony. Don't worry about what's going on around you geopolitically and within the nations, within all of this stuff, because these are just distractions to take you off your self. Did you hear that? These distractions are there to take you away from you being your true, authentic self. So that's my message for today. Don't give up. If you need help, reach out to me. I'm here to help you. I'm happy to help you. If you feel guided to, send me a message, make an appointment. Um, I am going to be changing the way that I do appointments from now on because so many people are booking appointments and very few are turning up. And I find that very rude. I find that very disappointing. And I also cannot replace that time to give to other people because that time is gone. And it's not about money. It's about that time. Time is precious to us all. So if you do make an appointment, Please respond to my emails, because if you don't respond to my emails, I will cancel your appointment. Sending you lots of love and light. Until the next time, take care and enjoy the day wherever you are. Bye-bye.